representative from the American Diabetes Association with information on prevention, symptoms, risk factors, and treatments that the public needs to know in order to help protect themselves and others. Although there is no cure for this disease, with daily medication and behavior modification, you can learn to live a healthy lifestyle with diabetes. According to the American Diabetes Association, 25.8 million people are currently living with diabetes in the United States. There are 18.8 million diagnosed and 7 million who have yet to receive a diagnosis. Healthcare providers are finding more and more children with type 2 diabetes, a disease usually diagnosed in adults aged 40 years or older. Diabetes is a disease where the body either does not produce insulin, called type 1 diabetes, or does not use insulin properly, which is type 2, and results in elevated blood sugar levels. Type 1 diabetes comes on quickly and happens unexpectedly, but type 2 diabetes can be prevented because it comes on gradually and there are many ways to avoid the disease. Risk factors for type 2 diabetes include being overweight, inactivity, family history, race, and being over age 45. Being able to notice symptoms is also a very important step in preventing the disease. Symptoms of diabetes include extreme thirst, frequent urination, increased hunger, weight loss, fatigue, blurred vision, and slow healing of wounds or cuts. If you recognize these symptoms in yourself or someone else, it is very important to be tested for diabetes. Our problem with diabetes is important because the public needs to know what diabetes is in case they're having the symptoms. Diabetes is a growing disease and the public should be aware that it's growing and it could happen to them at any time. The scariest aspects of diabetes are the complications that are involved, such as heart and blood vessel damage, nerve damage, kidney damage, foot sores, osteoporosis, and Alzheimer's disease. Diabetes is a growing issue and is becoming an emerging epidemic. Experts say that as we get older, we become less physically active, which results in weight gain, putting us at a higher risk of developing diabetes. Because of the fact that everybody gets older, we are all becoming more at risk every day. According to the U.S. National Library of Medicine, in just 30 years, the number of people in industrialized countries with diabetes has increased by 42%. It is up to us as individuals and as a community to make the effort to engage in healthier behaviors and lifestyles in order to prevent this disease to the best of our abilities.